Hey everybody and welcome to the Vehicle Group, TVG as they are known. And these guys are problem solvers. They deal with safety, they deal with security, and they deal with efficiency. And Ecolimit, a product that has been born out of solving a problem for one of their customers, is something that makes a difference to the electric van world. As we know, electric vehicles have a lot more poke than their diesel counterparts, but they don't need to have thanks to the intervention from Ecolimit from the vehicle group. Now this is gonna make a massive difference to fleets in efficiency and in safety. And we're gonna get under the skin of that over the next couple of days. So I've grabbed Mark, head of technical, to help me out understanding Ecolimit. Mark, how did Ecolimit come about? So Ecolimit came about by wanting to manipulate or limit the top speed and reverse speed of, um, of any vehicle, be that ICE or electric. So what exactly can Ecolimit do for us? Yeah, so a common problem with EVs is they've got a very, very high level of torque at really low um, speed limits. So not to 20 time can be mirror much more faster petrol cars. And what we're doing um, a lot is um, taking a little bit of that edge off across the power band um, so that they feel more like a diesel engine and, and something that pushes safety, pushes reliability, and pushes efficiency as well. It can extend that range that you get out of vehicles, but also it can um, police them speed limits as well. So efficiency and safety all wrapped up? Yeah, exactly, yeah. So Mark, I understand that there's been a problem with uh, driver ID. There's no technical enforcement of this. So it's a big problem in the industry, um, and, and thankfully our, our eco limit um, can help that, can be used to help that. Um, by enforcing a limp mode um, and, a, and a form of immobilisation so that before that um, driver ID is, is successfully authorised we can, we can control the, the limits of that vehicle and, and don't open it up until they've, they've gone through that. Um, Fantastic. That so no driver's going to want to be driving around at 5 or 10 miles an hour? Exactly that, yeah. <laughs> So as this is a customer's test vehicle, we're not going to show you uh, external moving shots of this vehicle because obviously some customers need a little privacy. So Ecolimit is solving two key problems. One problem, the problem of driver ID. So people can drive the vehicles without using this driver ID, but there is an audible deterrent that means that you would want to use this. But let's see if I can get going. As you can see, there doesn't seem to be much restriction beyond the noise as a deterrent, which is good, but it's not perfect. So we've seen the vehicle without the Ecolimit intervention, and now we have a vehicle with the Ecolimit intervention. Let's see what happens when I don't ID myself and drive off. That's me, foot to the floor. I'm doing 10 miles an hour and I can't go any faster until I use my ID. And there we go. We're away and we can do exactly what we want to do. So before we go any further, I am now gonna ID myself to remove that noise. But now I'm gonna just accelerate away with this unrestricted, uninhibited um, electric van. Now we know that they've got more power than their diesel counterparts, but let's see how we get on. What you can hear there is an audible intervention from one of the safety systems that are on the market that monitor driver behavior. Now that is telling me that I am not driving uh, safely and efficiently, which is helpful to know. But how does Ecolimit make a difference? So now with Ecolimit fitted, I'm gonna pull away in an enthusiastic fashion. And it is a much more managed experience, meaning that the vehicle is gonna perform more safely. There was no audible warnings from the uh, the equipment that is designed to monitor my behavior and I was able to pull away effectively and efficiently and this is going to give a number of benefits for fleets it's going to mean the tires are going to last longer it's going to mean that the vehicle is going to perform more efficiently 
therefore you are going to get longer range. So less time stopped, more uptime. The other challenge that Ecolimit is also addressing is that of speed limiting in reverse gear or forward gear, but that's for ice or electric. But we know that electric vehicles are pretty quick. So let's just see how quickly we can reverse in this vehicle. As you can hear, the acceleration was quite hard. And also, I don't know when we would have stopped. I just stopped because it was common sense to. So now the final test, the reversing test. We are going to put this in full reverse speed and see how we get along. As you can see, it is a much more managed experience and that is foot to the floor, top speed, five miles an hour. A big, big win. So I've got Kevin Henley, commercial director at TVG. This seems to be the next big thing, Eco Limit. Tell me, how's it going to benefit fleets? In, in so many ways. Um, obviously, with an ICE fleet, if a driver used a bit too much fuel, the impact would be quite limited in a you know, couple of minutes at a, a gas station refuel. Uh, with an EV, the impact is something far greater, which is employees' time, drivers' time. So hours off the road, rapid charging, not being as productive as it can be. So Ecolimit will absolutely control that usage of power and help sort of put more discipline into the charging mechanisms around there. Wow, so it sounds like it's really gonna reduce downtime and obviously the, the on cost of downtime. Absolutely. How can people get this? Uh, again, just reach out to us either via LinkedIn, company website or the standard inquiry line or reach out directly. We're happy to answer any questions. Um, and, and, and again, we're looking at a, a process where we can offer to trial the, the equipment for co potential clients as well. Fantastic. So you can get this in your vehicle and see what difference it can make. So that has been a snapshot of the Ecolimit tool from TVG. The possibilities of this tool are almost endless. They're all driving safety, efficiency, and compliance, and it can make a difference to your fleet, extending the performance of your electric vehicles, identifying your drivers, and reducing those low-speed impacts. This is fantastic. Reach out and find out more.